I hope you guys are doing great if you're new here my name is Yvonne and uh, on this channel we share content on home decor home styling interior design I'd be happy to have you join my family so consider hitting that subscribe button uh, today I want to do a day in the life I have so much happening today it's one of the um, one of my busiest days this month or rather this week today's Friday um, not this month let me say this week today's Friday so a lot of shopping so it will be from one shop to the other to the other I have to go get uh, carpets I have to go check on a bed that I was custom making I have to go check on a couch that is also being custom made and it's almost ready and then I have to go get coffee tables I have to go to one of the sites to just see progress on electrical works and then I have to go do an installation in another site for artwork I have an artwork piece over there so I'm taking those pieces to the site so that you can do the installation so I hope you get to enjoy this day with me our first stop is carpet crafts I have picked a carpet for one of the sites now I need two more pieces and I'm thinking I'll pick, show them this piece it's so beautiful I love the pattern it's so simple it's so nice so I'm kind of thinking I might go with this one I also love this but this is super modern it's like a super modern carpet I love this but I feel like the texture on this is just right and it's beautiful um, yeah just look at that. I wanted the grey version of this but it's sold out and I think I did this carpet in one of our villa projects so beautiful and so warm so I wish they had the grey one and I have gone with that uh, but yeah it's still a gorgeous piece um, so here's our carpet this is what we're carrying with us today and then I think I'll I plan and see if I'll come for this I also love this piece that is down here for like a kids play area because the colors are just beautiful and they pop so nicely so yeah. our next stop is pitari furniture we have a bed that was being custom made there so that's what i'm going to see because it's done and before they deliver i have to make sure it's um, perfect Bed, um, four by six, and the bedside. Um, whatever water are you putting? Which color? Do you have the mixi? Um, I also wanted to make sure that um, they knew the 
mattress we are working with is a spring mattress so that on top of the base they do for beds they can add like a board on top to just like protect the mattress which is like a plywood um yeah so i'll see you guys at the site that's our next stop for installations we are mounting artworks mirrors um doing some furniture assembling so see you at the next stop hey guys just made it to the second uh, stop which is the site um so we have some things being mounted at the moment uh, i think i'll go in and show you um so i think this is gonna take us like two hours and then we can move to the last site where we go see the electrical works so let's go in it's a beautiful house um yeah This shoe rack from IKEA that we want to assemble, and it's going to sit right here. Yeah, and we have our curtains up. It looks so beautiful. So beautiful. The right height, perfect color. So this is the shoe rack that needs to be done next before we do um, the TV as well. set up um, I think it's such a beautiful entryway piece uh, because you can put in your shoes um, and I've tried to kind of style it a bit to look good um, let me show you guys how it looks uh, on the inside So this is uh, the last project um, for the day and it's a beautiful art piece that I want to show you guys. It was actually a canvas and we framed it. My client had this and we decided to frame it. Ideal Dekoke did a good job. It looks so, so good. So this is our last piece. Alex is here. Say hi. hi. What's up? Yeah, so he does everything, mount works. And this is so beautiful. I can't wait to see it up. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> yeah, this is House of Royalty team. I can't wait to see it up. Let's go. Let's go. Good morning, you guys. Uh, so I thought this video would be like a day in the life uh, for just like me blogging yesterday. But we also have to do to continue this video today because some of the things that I was to do yesterday I wasn't able to do that. We ended up staying at the other site for long hours, um, so I wasn't able to go to the second site, and also I wasn't able to go buy some of the things that I needed to buy yesterday. So what we'll do is continue this vlog um, today, and I uh, will actually close this video today. So I'm at the second site. Um, electrical works still in progress. I don't go and um, film over there because the guys are super super busy so I don't want to distract them. But also I passed by Oka Deco to get some light fixtures and um, yeah we have a few pieces over here. So this is like my storage room. I know you guys will be able to see that we the scenes of this project but this is my storage room for like items that we bought. We shipped some pieces from Ikea. Um, and then also like everything else that I buy, I come and store them here. I, let me show you one of the pieces, one of my most beautiful pieces for the girls room, which is this basket light. 
it's so gorgeous and then it's not bulky so i can't wait to see this half and we have more like fixtures in here we have more like fixtures being delivered today there's a lot happening so we're getting ready for the installation day which should be it should be next week today is um on saturday so we should be able to finalize everything uh, by the end of next week i think i'll show you kidogo what you're doing with the electrical work so that will also be quite the scenes of um this project and then after that we are going to buy coffee a coffee table and some decor pieces um i think the, the shop is called alvis home decor it's along campo road so yeah shop place i want to pick this piece and it comes with a bigger piece that i'm gonna show you guys um so this is the bigger piece this is what i want to take and then you can combine the two of them it's actually quite strong and i love the walnut color and the black legs so i think that's a beautiful piece and then i want to pick this piece as a side tool for an old client of mine who actually needs a simple side too. So I think the black will work well with what we did um, in our house. Yeah, but this is a nice shop. It has some beautiful pieces that you guys would love. Finished up at the deco shop and um, I think I have secured most of the stuff. Uh, yeah. Guys, you know what? We are going to make this a few days in the life, not a day in the life, because this is the third day. And it's because when I look at the content that I take for you, um, like at the end of the day, when I look at the content I've captured that day, it's not enough for a vlog. So this is the third day and uh, let's just move with the flow i think i'm going not to close this tomorrow i don't know um but again i've been having crazy busy days um we are finalizing on some of our projects uh we try and take two projects every month and um it's like we are finalizing on these projects at the same time and we've been doing a lot of shopping i just got back home i've been shopping from morning like you can see even have a new baby over there i got that plant from okadeko it's not mine it's for a client i got two pieces i think they're beautiful it's an artificial uh fiddle leaf which i think is beautiful for any home um for any style it's such a beautiful piece and it looks so real so yeah doing a lot of shopping today um everyone else is just doing their part which is which is exciting because teamwork just makes everything much much better but one thing i can say is if there's no planning that goes into these projects we could be a mess you guys we could be a mess um right now i want to go to santana africa to check on a couch uh, that they're custom making for one of these projects um i think at the beginning of this video i'd mentioned something like going to see or rather to check on a couch and i wasn't able to do that day one now we're gonna do it today it's actually being delivered today we've been going to just like see um the entire you know progress of like the couch or rather the process of like the stitching putting the cushions so we've been involved a lot in that and today is the last day so i just want to go and see um if the stitching has been like done perfectly and then i can deliver the couch to my client later in the evening so it's at around 3 p.m uh, so i have to leave any minute now like after this um intro so i have to leave um so i'm excited i'm so excited today i woke up in the morning and i was so excited because i can see um the houses are gosh the houses are so beautiful i know i haven't gotten to share much um in this vlog because you're working on another vlog that will be like the reveal but still we'll have like weird the scenes put in that same video so that you can walk the journey with us or you can get to enjoy that process with us so i don't want to do a lot of site visits in this video that's why we've been focusing a lot on the shopping bit uh, but one thing i can tell you guys when it comes to these projects there's just a lot of planning that goes into it a lot of planning 
planning, making sure that even everybody who is involved in this project, even the fundies and um, just anyone, the third party team, everyone who is part of this knows what they are, what they are supposed to do. But I wake up every day and I am grateful that I get to do what I do. And I look back like the first, first, first days when I started doing um, or rather taking projects, there is so much that I didn't know and through experience and being able to do this more and more, I've been able to like learn a lot learn a lot when it comes to like projects and also how to not projects to when it comes to planning and how to deal with you know clients and fundies and just everybody who is part of like the project um and i remember at the beginning there's um this class that i took on skillshare that i'm going to plug you guys on uh but before that um the reason i wanted to share this is because when you take a project you just don't do whatever you want you know you have to plan for it you have to like visualize how that space is going to turn out so like i said there are a lot of planning in that from the first day you meet the client and do that that consultation you have to have a better understanding of what they want what style do they want what is the budget like you have to ask the main and main questions uh so that also you're able to plan yourself throughout the month and know okay this is what i'm doing am i custom making a couch are we buying a couch so there's a lot of um research and also planning that goes into this and going back to the class that i wanted to talk to you guys about which is one of my favorite classes on skillshare and i'm happy that they have partnered with me um on this video so this class that i'm going to share with you guys just if you love to you know decorate um spaces or if you want to just like spruce up your space and make it look better and nice and i think at the beginning of my journey it's one of the classes that i took and i always go back to this class when i need some inspiration i need some motivation for my project and this class is by aline anandes it's called create a plan for your perfect room and one of the main reasons that i actually love this class is because she's able to take you from the first step like of what you need to do with any project to the last step so you're able to like walk that design journey process with her and she's able to guide you on exactly what you're supposed to do so that the entire process is easy and another thing that she talks about that i love is planning and visualization which i think is also very important in whatever project because you want to have a vision like what are you working with so in terms of like materials in terms of like color palette and she talks even more about functionality in this lesson and this is very important because when you know how a room functions for you then you're able to plan for that space and Another exciting thing that she talks about in this class is creating mood boards, which is something that I enjoy. I like putting together mood boards for my space. I like putting mood boards together for my clients. I think it's a good presentation of the design that you're going to work with. So whenever you present a mood board to the client, they're able to be part of the design process. They're able to like walk that journey with you with a better understanding of what you're going to do with that space, which I think is super, super amazing. So thank you so much Skillshare for partnering with me on this video. And I know you guys might be asking what is Skillshare. So Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands and thousands of classes for just anyone who wants to explore their creativity. If you want to learn a new skill, if you want to invest in yourself, I think it's just a good, good community to be part of. And they have classes starting from photography to illustration to freelancing to interior design, which is one of the main classes that I love to take on Skillshare. So I'd be happy if you guys go to check the link that they have shared with me because they were nice enough to also want you guys to be part of their community so for the first a thousand of you to click the link that i'm going to leave in the description box below you get to enjoy one month free um try on skillshare which i think is super super amazing so again thank you so much skillshare for being part of this video and i'm going to leave all the information that you guys might need in the description box below just in case you'd be interested now let's go check on our couch Hey guys, I just got at the workshop. I'm at uh, Santana Africa's workshop where we are doing the couch and it's done. It's so, so, so beautiful. Um, so this is the piece. It's so big, like super, super, super big. It's around 10 feet by 6 feet and it's so comfortable. We put some springs in it um, to just make sure it's comfortable and oh my god, I'm so happy. I can't wait to see how my client reacts to this. Uh, so it feels like my approval, it can go home, ah, I'm so happy, it's so beautiful. I just can't wait for my couch to be ready because I'm so making my couch. I am so happy, it's so beautiful.
You guys, look at the detail. Look at the detail. Look at the piping. Because my client actually loves piping, so we went with some piping on this. Um, just look at all this. The detail is so beautiful. <laughs> Hey guys, the quality is trash at this Hawaii. It's at around 9:30 p.m. I just got back home. I uh, delivered my uh, my client's couch uh, myself. I like to be there when deliveries are being done, and I just wanted to see her reaction and to just know how she feels about the couch. She's so happy. She's genuinely happy, and I am genuinely happy. So that. That can close the day for me. I can sleep like a baby tonight. Um, so that's the update I wanted to give you guys. Um, so I think I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Um, yeah. Good morning, guys. It's a new day, and I'm at Thailand Carpet Mombasa Road. I want to get a carpet and uh, to look at fabrics. I want to do something for. I want to use a fabric for the kitchen window to just like do a beautiful. Um, what do I call it? I want to have blades um, in, a in a client's kitchen, so I want to see a very nice light fabric that I could use. Um, yeah, so that's my day today, and then pass by, I think I can pass by Moda Fabrics to also see the fabrics they have, and also pass by Odds, because uh, they're still along Mombasa Road uh, to pay for some balcony chairs that I saw. They're not actually balcony chairs, but I want to make them a uh, balcony chair, so Let's go in. Um, like I said, I'm at Thailand Carpet. It's Palenuma, so let's go and see if we find a carpet. That's a nice print. Mm -mm. That's nice. Have you already shared your tenner? It's cute. Okay. that I'd not be able to show you that living room makeover. Maybe I'll be able to do something for Instagram, but I don't know. I don't know. But it's such a beautiful carpet. Now, I, I've also seen fabrics. I had mentioned that I'll be looking at fabrics. I've seen two that we could use. Um, so I'll have my assistant also check Moda because I've been, been able to go to Moda and then we compare and see the one that we're taking for the kitchen. Um, and then now I'm in route to Odds to pay for the balcony chairs. So I think that's our next stop. Hey guys, it's actually later in the evening. I got back home. I had a lot of work to do. So today I thought I could actually do a lot of content for you to like take you through the entire shopping process. Um, but at my day, like after Italian carpet, my day got so, so, so busy. It was one call after another, after another. Yeah, it became so bad i had to go to to the site there are some things i needed to sort out at the site and the fundies were just like seated and waiting for me Nanilikwa Mombasa road and the site is far so um i went towards actually and i got the balcony chairs but it was just like in and out in and out so made payments um i think i'm just gonna post a small video over here so that you guys can get to see the chairs they're actually beautiful and um the chairs that you can use maybe in your dining area or in your balcony the material is perfect for just like outdoor and indoors so yeah made payments for that so i was in table i actually i think i um i was there for just like five minutes because i have someone there who helps me so i just told him you know what just 
WhatsApp me the invoice and I'm gonna pay for the chairs on the move. So yeah, I rushed to the side and uh, from there I could not even think about creating this content but um or rather like continuing with the vlog but the day turned out amazing whatever needed to be sorted out was sorted out and ah uh, yo it's i i'm still not quite sure if i'm going to be sharing that project but if i do you guys will be able to see like what we've done with that home it's so beautiful but anyway so i've been home sorting out budgets um today i have spent so much money so i needed to just like sit down and uh be able to track the budget just like make sure we're also within budget so i've been doing that for the last like one hour and i want to go grab a shower and i thought i could uh close this video right here so thank you thank you thank you so much for spending these few days with me um i think you guys have been able now to see like how my days look like it's always a lot of shopping if not it's days at the site um but yeah it was fun filming this for you guys and i hope you enjoyed it for any information or if there's anything i plugged you on i'm gonna leave that in the description box below so that you can um use the links or rather get a number from my description box so yeah thank you thank you thank you so much for engaging with me um for the few minutes i don't know if i don't know how long this video was but thank you so so much if you loved this video give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed kindly subscribe and i'm gonna see you guys in the next one bye bye let's hope that and wait